Tis the season for gift shopping, family dinners, and busy holiday schedules. And this year, I'll be getting things done with the brain. You can see that I've created a holiday area in my brain to keep track of important events, tasks, and responsibilities. For example, when it's time to add a new event to my schedule, I'll start by creating a new thought in my brain. I can then add notes regarding the event, and I'll be sure to create an event reminder. I set the specific date and time, and even add a label or additional information if needed. Most importantly, I'll set the reminder. The brain will remind me one hour prior to the start of this event. And I can always review my schedule in the brain timeline. As you can see, my holiday calendar is really filling up quickly. It's really great to get these events off of my mind and into the brain. The next steps in my holiday brain is to keep track of all my gift shopping. Notice that I keep a checklist on my family gifts thought. Anytime I have a new item to purchase, I simply add it to my list. Sometimes my note will even remind me that I already have an existing thought that matches what I've just typed in. This saves me a lot of time in my research. Since I already have a thought for fly fishing reels that I like, I can now link to it from my family gifts thought for easy access in the future. All of the child thoughts below family gifts are for further research or web links to common shopping sites that I frequent during the holiday shopping season. Luckily, the brain loads these right up in the content window for easy access. And when I complete a purchase, I can return to my note and check the item off my list. So I'll always remember what's been taken care of and what still needs to get done. I also utilize thought tags in my brain. Tags are a great way to add priority levels or just additional context to thoughts in my brain. From the brain toolbar, I can quickly access all thoughts in this brain that have a top priority tag. Some of my current top priorities are getting my holiday cards completed, signing up for a triathlon in the new year, and installing a new kitchen faucet. One of my current top priorities is planning a family camping trip to Yosemite. Well, with our busy schedules in the current climate, my family and I have decided it would be best to push this event back for a while. It's time to recategorize this thought. So I'll create a new tag called back burner. I can then return to the Yosemite thought where I can click to open the thought properties display and make tag or other modifications to the thought. Or from the Plex, I can right click on the current top priority tag and replace it with back burner. So the thought and all of the research that I've put into the Yosemite trip are still in my brain. But as you can see, planning my Yosemite trip no longer appears as a top priority. I can now stay focused on all of my most important topics. I'll click on one of these top priority thoughts, my holiday cards. In this area of my brain, I have file attachments for my return address labels, addresses that I'm sending to, and quick access to other commonly used mail and shipping companies. I'll even drag and drop the family photo that I'll be using for my cards into my brain, where it will appear as a zoomable icon for the holiday card thought. I'm really getting into the spirit of Christmas now, and to take it one step further, I think I'll load up a customized holiday wallpaper. I right click on the background to open the brain theme window, and on the options tab, I'll select a new image for the background. Nothing can stop me now from really getting into the holiday spirit, I'm staying organized, taking control of my holiday schedule, and really getting things done with the brain. <laughs>